The stunning Abu Dhabi Golf Club was the venue for the second G4D event of the season, the G4D at Hero Cup, where 10 of the best golfers in the world rankings for golfers with disability teed it up in the Middle Eastern sunshine. Overnight leader Juan Postigo Arce set the pace on day one with a one over par round of 73. The Spaniard off to the perfect start here at the par four first. He would hold that for birdie and go level par for the tournament. American debutant Jeremy Bittner was certainly enjoying the week. Despite a mammoth 24-hour journey from his native Pittsburgh, Bittner showed some moments of brilliance here in Abu Dhabi. This at the par 5 10th, giving the 34-year-old a rare birdie. Winner of last year's G4D event in Northern Ireland, Italian Tommaso Perino had another strong showing this week. This approach at the par 3 15th would lead to his only birdie of the round. He would go on to finish in sixth spot. Behind Bradley Smith. Despite a poor start, the Englishman recovered at the turn and posted a strong finish. This putt at 12, one of two back nine birdies on the final day. And speaking of birdie, South Africa's David Watts put together an impressive run of three on the bounce between the 15th and 17th holes. This putt on 15 sending him on the way to a fifth spot finish. That's one shot behind Englishman Mike Brown. This the ideal start to his second round and he would go on to make three more birdies. Five bogeys though would see him sign for a final round 73 and sole possession of fourth spot. At the business end of the leaderboard, it was a three-way tussle between some of the highest ranked players in the world. Ireland's Brendan Lawler making an early charge with this chip in at the first. As Lawler made a move with three frontline birdies, Canada's Curtis Barkley had all the answers. Birdies at the first and second bringing him into contention. Alongside overnight leader Arce, who remained composed throughout. This tee shot on 12 ensuring he would stay on top of things at level par for the tournament. Playing partner Barkley however maintained the pressure on the Spaniard. Birdie here at 12, a potential hammer blow. But the 27 year old who was born without much of his right leg and no knee responded in perfect fashion with a birdie of his own. It was enough to move three shots clear of the field heading up the last. And despite bogey on 18, Juan Postigo Arce tapped in to claim a maiden G4D title. And the delight was plain to see. Confirmation then of Postigo Arce's win, finishing two shots clear of Canada's Curtis Barkley and three ahead of former world number one Brendan Lawler. The Spaniard relieved to finally cross the line. Oh, it feels great after last year that I played pretty good golf around around the globe, but the, the win did, didn't come. I think it's great to start 2023 this way and uh, hopefully much many more to come. Delight then in the Abu Dhabi sunshine for Spain's Juan Postigo Arce. To watch another DP World Tour video, click here and to subscribe, click here.